Hey guys, thank you for stopping by Spare Outdoors. Today, we're gonna to turn this plastic bottle into plastic cordage. You can use this cordage for fishing string. You can stake out your tent with it. You can lash up your tripod with it. So, without further ado, let's get busy. Now to make this plastic cordage, I found a dead stump, an old dead pine tree. What we're gonna do is we're gonna cut in a pie shape across the top and then we're gonna come down and cut halfway through down here on the bottom. This way we can jam our knife up in there and we can pull the cordage through, you'll see. All right, we're gonna start right here in the middle of this stump. We're gonna cut about an inch or so down and then we're gonna come on the side and we're gonna cut about an inch or so down on the side as well. Just watch your fingers, don't cut yourself. Now you wanna cut this down about an inch. Now, you wanna come right here on this side where the bottom of that cut is that you made, and you wanna cut it across here, about an inch deep, or about halfway through. Now that you've cut it halfway through, you wanna take your trusty but not rusty knife and cut it a little pie wedge out of here just like this trim that up Now, it should look like a piece of pie. You have this side here where your knife is gonna go, and you have this side here where the bottle's gonna go. You're gonna feed the plastic bottle through this cut. The plastic's gonna hit your knife blade, and you're gonna be able to pull the string all the way through. Now we're gonna process the bottle. There is a line on the bottle, and you wanna cut smoothly all the way across where that line is. And then try to make it as straight of a cut as you can make it. Now you have a bowl you can use in your camp and a little bit later I'll show you that we'll have a funnel as well. This is not the straightest cut around here but we can still use it. Just trim it up a little bit. Now we straighten this edge up and we can go ahead and start processing it to make it our string. All right, now you wanna take and make a small little cut right here. And this is what we're gonna to use to start our string off with. We made a little tag on this end and that's what we're gonna to use to start our string with. Now we're gonna insert the knife into the wood. And what I found, you're gonna put it right into that corner. And what I found with this is that if you angle the knife up just ever so slightly, it will cut straighter. So you're going to push this in and you're going to bring this knife around just like that and make it nice and tight. Now you're going to insert your bottle. And that tag end that we did is going to slide underneath your knife blade. Once your tag end comes out, you want to just pull and twist the bottle around just like so. You want to pull this until it freely starts spinning. Now once it starts spinning, you could just continue to pull. And it's making and this is making plastic string now. See the cordage it's making? Now let's do the rest of the bottle.
Now we've effectively made about 100 feet of plastic cordage. And this stuff is a little over an eighth of an inch thick. And this stuff is very strong. And if you try to break it with your hands, it'll cut you before it breaks. But you can use this as fishing string. I've already done it on TikTok. You can check that video out. You can use this string to lash up your tripod. You can even use it to stake out your tarp or your tent and you can use it for fishing you can use it to lash up poles you can do a thousand different things with this stuff it's basically cordage anything that you need cordage for you can use this for and it's very strong very durable not only did we get close to 100 feet of plastic cordage we also got a funnel we can use and we also got a bowl we can use in camp hey guys i hope this video was helpful leave a comment let me know if you've ever used this i can't take credit for it because i saw it on king of random and then also i saw creek stewart do it but it is a very useful tip to get out there so everybody can know how to do this in an emergency but i hope you enjoyed this video leave me a comment leave me a like subscribe and i'll see you next time on spare outdoors god bless you